Net Support Manager integrates with Microsoft's Active Directory structure and enables you to manage control and client configurations centrally. Now, from NetSupport Manager version 12 and onwards, these configurations can be integrated using ADMX files. We previously only offered ADM, and now we have the ADMX templates as well. You can find these by navigating to the NetSupport Manager folder on your local device that has Manager installed. We're going to go into the C drive, Program Files x86, NetSupport, NetSupport Manager, ADM templates, and ADMX templates. Now you can see all the files that are available. Now note you'll see some that say NSS. That's for the Net Support School component for training and onboarding. Otherwise, you'll use the Net Support Client and Net Support Control ADMX templates. There are four of those available. The Net Support Control User template contains user policies, configurable options that will be applied to the manager control. Now, the Net Support Control Machine template is a machine policy containing configurable options applied to the Net Support Manager control. So, machine versus user are available. And same thing for the client. You can configure based on the machine itself or based on individual user profiles. Now, when you install the NetSupport Manager template files, you need to make sure that you edit all of these and then copy them back into the ADMX template folder. To apply an ADMX file to your Active Directory environment, you need to go through the Group Policy Management Console. Then the ADMX files listed above and their corresponding ADML files will need to be copied to your domain central store. For more information on applying ADMX templates and files, you can visit NetSupport Manager dot com and select our support option to go into our knowledge base where we have articles about the ADMX templates walking you through the steps and giving you directions for how to apply that and what you need to do in order to edit those files.